Hey guys, welcome to my Algonquin Provincial Park vlog. The weather is not great today, but we're still gonna try and get some hiking in. And the colors in Algonquin Park are just beautiful at the moment. I've already seen like some really red trees on the way here. So I'm very excited to be able to see that because that's what was missing from the first Ontario road trip vlog. We're gonna get it all in in this vlog. Now I got this map at the visitor center. Um, I went into the park around here and I'm staying like about half an hour kind of south east from here. And the first thing I decided to go to is the lookout here at number 10. There's another one, number two, but that's about 30 kilometers away. So I thought since I'm already on this side of the park, I'm going to have a look at this one first because on this side, we're meant to have like the greatest colors in the park. So I'm going to have a look here and if I feel like I want to see more, I can always go all the way over here to number two to see more of kind of the maple leaf colors. Back from the first lookout, but I do think I'm gonna go check out the second one because I think there can still be more red and more colors. But if you've been to North America this time of year, I'd love to know from you. Like, because at the moment the trees are still very yellow. Like, are they just gonna all fall off or are more of them gonna turn red as kind of the season progresses? Let me know in the comments. I'm really curious about that, if there's hope for me to see more red kind of later on this trip. Unfortunately, the second lookout trail is closed, so I decided to do a little walk around the lake here instead, but now it's raining. But it's still pretty. at Algonquin Park for the day and I was kind of driving back to my hostel and then I had to pull over to show you this because this is absolutely stunning have a look like behind me there's like a lake and all the trees are all turning red and then when you look on the other side of the road when you look there it's all kind of changing as well and it's so so beautiful I mean just look at it it's gorgeous and I'm in love with it. It's so pretty. Everything's like colorful forests and beautiful lakes and Ontario is really beautiful. Hey guys, it is road trip day five. Today we're leaving the Algonquin region and we're gonna start driving down towards the Great Lakes again because I'm going to the Thousand Islands area. I just stopped at Tim Horton to get myself a pumpkin spice latte with a coffee, of course, because I don't drink coffee, but I kind of like this place because it's like, it's so Canadian. Yay. Just arrived in my hotel in Gananoque. This time I had to book a hotel because there's no hostels here in town. So I booked a hotel for myself. And like, if, as you can see, like it's pretty big. Like there's two double beds in here. So I'm pretty pleased, that's pretty good. Like I paid double what I'd normally pay for a hostel, but a bit of luxury, won't hurt. All the Gananoque and Thousand Islands content is gonna be in the next vlog, so make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss that. And then I'll see you in my next video.